A GOOSE HAS EVERYONE TALKING AT A CHEROKEE COUNTY SHOPPING CENTER. THE CANADA GOOSE TOOK UP RESIDENCE LAST SUMMER AND WON'T LEAVE. <laughs> Channel 2's Baron Peterson is live in Woodstock, and Baron, this goose apparently lost its mate not too long ago. Now, the merchants of the shops of Molly Lane don't like loitering, but this one time they're willing to make an exception. They got a soft spot for this silly goose. The shops of Woodstock features a nice, neat row of stores, and recently, they got a new tenant. Yeah, we've all go, grown pretty fond of him um, because we're an organization run by volunteers, so there's a lot of volunteers who have tender hearts for him and his plight. A Canada goose that hangs around like it owns the place. Yes, well, I tell you, I was here last week and it was walking across the street. All the cars were stopping and letting it go by. Both merchants and customers say it showed up over the summer, but a few months back, its mate was hit by a car. I just feel bad for him. I mean, he, does, he doesn't leave a mess in front of my store, but uh, I just feel bad for him. I mean, he, doesn't, he just doesn't need to live on the concrete. Yeah. He needs a gaggle. It's true that Canada geese mate for life. And while most around here believe the bird is depressed because it no longer has a partner, an officer with the Georgia Department of Natural Resources says if the goose has food and cover, life is good. And it will likely move on in a few months and find a new mate. But some in this strip mall... Would like to help him out. Goosematch.com. We need to we need to get him an online profile and see if we can't find him a new mate, make him happy again. The Canada goose is a protected species. It's against federal law to harm one. The DNR says don't feed it, leave it alone, and hopefully he will avoid all the traffic around here and hook up with a gaggle of geese sometime early this summer. We're live in Cherokee County, Barrett Peterson, Channel 2 Action News.